So we talked about setting up your radial art line stuff earlier. I'm just gonna kind of quickly touch on, there's a few differences um, between the radial art line setup and the femoral art line setup if they're doing that. And then another way that we're using our art line sets up um, are for Raboas. Um, and so I'm just gonna give you kind of a crash course on what you need to know for that. Everything for the radial art line is gonna be the same for the femoral art line, except for what they're actually accessing with. So in our trauma pixis with all of the other art line materials, there is an arrow kit and it will say femoral arterial catheterization kit on it. This has everything they need to actually do their accessing of the groin for that. You will still set up your transducer and your bag of saline and pressure bag the exact same way. You just don't have to grab all the other supplies like the chloroprep and the you know art line access needle itself. All of that comes in this arrow kit. You zero it the same way, the transducer still goes at the level of the heart. Nothing else is different except this contains all the supplies they need for the actual access kit. The other thing that I'll touch on too is we've recently started doing Reboa and all of your Reboa stuff is going to be in the trauma carts and the trauma rooms. There's a big drawer that says Reboa on it. All that you need to know from a nursing standpoint is for the trauma surgeons to set up Reboa, you have to have an art line kit set up the exact same way that you would for a radial art line or femoral art line. You need the pressure bag, the saline, the transducer cable and tubing. And that has to be primed, ready to go before the Rebo catheter is inserted because it has to be primed before they can actually put that in the femoral artery. You don't have to worry about what all that they're gonna need for that other than you need to know it's in the trauma cart and all of the trauma rooms and you have to have an art line set up ready to go for them when they do it. And it's gonna happen very fast. So if you hear someone saying that a patient's gonna be a candidate for Reboa, go ahead and get that art line tubing and everything set up ready to go and primed for them because as soon as they get that in they're going to go ahead and hook it up and start looking at um, the measurements for that and go ahead and blow that balloon up to stop bleeding.